Hey there, foodies! Are you looking to step your game up in the kitchen? Cooking oils can be just the right ingredient to increase the quality of your food. Today, we'll talk about seven great cooking oils. From canola to avocado, we'll also touch on which methods of cooking each oil works the best with. Let's begin, shall we? Number 1. Canola Oil We're kicking things off with one of the most popular cooking oils. Canola oil is a vegetable-based oil that derives from the rapeseed plant. Due to its light flavor, smoke point, and rich texture, canola has been the go-to cooking oil for quite some time. While it has traditionally been associated with fried foods, canola oil also works well with baking and roasting. This leaves the door open for a wide variety of cooking methods, including stir-frying and sautéing. Canola oil can also be used as a worthy substitute for butter or margarine. In recent years, there's been a stigma attached to canola oil, one that's compelled some to avoid cooking with it. You see, canola oil contains urucic acid. This is a type of monosaturated omega-3 fatty acid that's been linked to respiratory illness and blindness. As it turns out, the level of erucic acid in canola is below the FDA's standard. In reality, canola is considered to be generally healthy. It's low in fat at roughly 7% and high in monosaturated fat at 63%. It also carries phytosterols, which help to absorb cholesterol. With that said, caution must be taken with canola oil. Despite having some benefits, research has suggested to take caution. A study from 2013 focused on a large group of men who replaced saturated fats with unsaturated vegetable oil. While the cholesterol levels were low, they had displayed higher rates of heart and coronary artery disease. Further research must be conducted as to why. While the amount of canola you use varies depending on what you're cooking, it's generally recommended to use it in moderation. Number 2. Extra Virgin Olive Oil we continue with another extremely popular cooking oil. Extra virgin olive oil is considered by many experts to be the healthiest fat on earth. Just ask countries where the Mediterranean diet is popular. They use it all the time. What other oil would you really want to cook with? To put it simply, olive oil is an oil made from the extract of an olive. Extra virgin olive oil is the least processed of any of the three main grades the other two being refined olive oil and regular virgin. It contains great vitamin E and K, as well as 14% saturated fats. Monosaturated fats are where the real jackpot is. One tablespoon contains 73% of your daily value. Extra virgin olive oil also contains plenty of antioxidants that help to fight against disease. It can help fight inflammation and cardiovascular issues. There's also a claim that it can combat both Alzheimer's and cancer. Extra virgin olive oil is great for both frying and roasting foods. It can help boost the flavor, color, and smell of whatever dish you're creating. The foods it goes particularly well with include soup, bruschetta, pasta sauce, and various cheese selections. It's best to cook it at approximately 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Number 3 peanut oil. Have you heard of peanut oil before? If you're looking to add some extreme flavor to your dish, this is an ideal choice. Also known as groundnut oil, peanut oil is extracted from, uh, you guessed it, peanuts. It's great for frying and sautéing foods. It's recommended for stir fries as well as peanut butter cookies. It has a high smoke point at 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Peanut oil is low in bad fat and high in monosaturated fats. This can help lower your cholesterol and possibly prevent heart disease. Peanut oil also carries 11% of your vitamin E intake. Vitamin E intake is an antioxidant that works to protect you from free radicals. When cooked with the proper dish, peanut oil can boost the flavor. It can taste mild, medium, and strong, enhancing your food whichever way you please. Number 4. Coconut Oil If you're planning on frying up a meal over the stove, cook something that coconut oil would mix well with. Possessing a smoke point of 350 degrees, it works well on a variety of foods including meat, eggs, and fish. A couple of teaspoons also work well in tea or coffee. 
coconut oil has plenty of amazing benefits. For instance, around 90% of the fatty acids in coconut oils are saturated. A single tablespoon contains around 60% of your daily value of saturated fats. It's recommended that you use no more than two tablespoons for your cooking. This amount is said to reduce belly fat. Coconut oil can potentially increase your level of good cholesterol. This is due to its saturated fat content, which will lower your blood pressure. If this is true, it can prevent heart disease from developing. But a study conducted in 2016 showed no clear evidence that coconut oil harms or benefits your cholesterol level. Coconut oil assists with food digestion, eliminating bad bacteria and inflammation. With that being said, you need to make sure that you're using coconut oil in moderation. You see, it's high in calories. Just a single tablespoon equals 117. So while it increases the quality of the flavor in your meal, it doesn't hurt to be cautious. Are you finding this useful so far? Are you thinking of some great dishes you can use these oils in? The next one is sure to be your favorite. But before we continue, are you concerned about the overall state of your health? Perhaps you'd like our recent video on what eating an orange every day can do to your body. Want to switch things up? If you're looking for that special someone, check out our list on 17 reasons why dating a Leo is the best thing ever. Now, let's get back to our list of best cooking oils. Number 5. Avocado Oil When the word avocado is said out loud, expect health food maniacs to come running. Avocado oil is taken straight from the pressed fruit itself and serves as a great addition to your frying pan. With a high smoke point of 400 degrees, avocado oil works great with your vegetables. It's also said to be a helpful ingredient in homemade mayonnaise as well as salad. While it is a lesser known member of the cooking oil family and doesn't carry the flavor of coconut oil, it packs amazing health benefits. When it's added to a vegetable dense salad, avocado oil can boost the levels of carotenoids, an important antioxidant your body needs to absorb. Avocado oil can also reduce arthritis, increase your level of good cholesterol, and help prevent you from gum disease. This cooking oil can be a fantastic aid in the kitchen. Number 6. Sesame Oil A vegetable oil taken from sesame seeds? Sign me up! Sesame has been affectionately labeled the queen of the oil seeds. An ideal choice for sautéing your favorite foods, sesame oil is a staple in the kitchen of any cooking enthusiast. With a smoke point of 410 degrees, sesame oil does a great job when added to beef and broccoli, noodles, and chicken stir-fry. Like all of the oils we've mentioned, guess what? It's also extremely healthy for you. For one, it's rolling in antioxidants, which will reduce cell damage and combat free radicals. A 2013 study was conducted where researchers gave rats sesame oil supplements. By the end, they'd found that the animals were protected from heart cell damage. Another study conducted on rats showed that a small percentage of sesame oil for 42 days resulted in decreased blood sugar. So take your best pieces of beef and veggies out of the fridge, then grab the sesame oil. I think a properly made stir-fry will do your health some good. Number 7. Safflower Oil Those of you who are new to cooking oil may be unfamiliar with this pick. Taken from the spiked plant, safflower oil is the right choice when cooking your meal requires a heck of a lot of heat. Seriously. A 400 degree smoke point is child's play for this cooking oil. Safflower possesses a high smoke point of 510 degrees Fahrenheit. A bonus on top of its cooking benefits, safflower oil is rich in monosaturated fats. Studies have indicated that safflower oil can help to improve the health of people with type 2 diabetes. This means everything from cholesterol to blood sugar. A 2011 study indicated that four months of safflower oil consumption is required to see improved cholesterol. So, if you need to cook something at a high temperature, you should become acquainted with safflower oil. Do you enjoy cooking? Would you consider any of these cooking oils after watching this video? Let us know in the comment section below. We'd love to hear from you. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait! What kind of bestie would we be if we didn't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video and enjoy!